Greetings. Let's chat about a location privacy concern from everyday life. A location privacy concern from everyday life. I recently presented at a GIS conference focused on community colleges. On day two of the conference, one of the attendees reported that on the previous evening, he and his family attended a game at the local baseball stadium. As they were standing in line, a promoter was there giving away a free bobblehead of some sort. Why do I put the word free in these air quotes? Because there is almost always a cost. In this case, the promoter's requirement and the participant's cost was to scan your driver's license. Yes, you heard right. Scan your driver's license. That's certainly not free. My colleague who relayed all this to me decided, no way am I going to have my license scanned. And indeed, he had just participated in my ethics workshop that same day. Therefore, he was not in the line of people and not able to talk to the promoter as to why the promoter felt they needed to scan people's licenses. I wonder if the promoter had a disclaimer saying that they would not sell or give away the information they were gathering. But even if they had the best intentions, once that information is digital, as we have detailed in our Spatial Reserves book and in our blog over the last 12 years, data breaches can and do occur despite what may be noble intentions of keeping it private as evidenced by the recent sad linkedin news about a new breach of billions of passwords as probably many of you listening to this video and reading our related essay are like me frequently on work travel you can attest to the following our licenses get scanned every time we go through security at an airport that said i suppose one could argue is the baseball field incident any different from the airport? In my mind, the airport is more important to me than, than the baseball game. I have a few options at the airport for sure. If I don't agree to have my license scanned, I don't fly. But at the baseball game, I can take or leave the prize. It's not that important to me. If I can have one less scan of my personal information during the day, I regard that as a good thing, even if I miss out on what may have been an interesting prize. Let me just say here that there's no prize I can fathom worth scanning my personal information for. The most disturbing thing to me about the baseball game story is not so much that the promoters felt they needed to scan the licenses, but that, according to my colleague, there was a long line of people perfectly willing to have their licenses scanned. Now, I'm not being critical of these folks, but through this and other essays and videos, for example, on our Spatial Reserves Data and Society blog, we are just encouraging people to think about location privacy, along with other ethical issues such as copyright, data quality, and being thoughtful about the choices we make when mapping and sharing our maps, information, and data. What are your thoughts about this? Am I overly concerned about promotions such as this scanning personal information or not? And now for a geographic quiz for you all. Here's another stadium. I took a picture right here. Where is this located? Where is this located? This is not the stadium where the licenses were being scanned, but it is a wonderful stadium that I visited during one of my work travels. Any guesses as to where this is? I'll leave you with that. Keep on thinking spatially. Thanks.